Hey everyone, it's been a while. Uh, it's been a long while. I've not done any videos. Um, you know, a lot of stuff going on here. You know, I moved from New York and uh, moved from New York to a smaller place in Ohio. Um, very happy here. Very happy here. Uh, if you're new to my channel, and just starting to watch them, welcome. Uh, if you've been in my channels before, welcome back. <laughs> I'm sorry, like I said, I'm sorry that it, a lot of stuff has been delayed. Um, you know, it's just, like I said, a lot going on. I'm doing a lot better. I'm still on my testosterone. Um, you know, I still work out, uh, growing a beard. <laughs> I'm very happy with my beard. Uh, plan on growing it out more, uh, especially for this winter. Uh, where we're at in Ohio, it gets really, really cold here. I think it gets colder here than it does in New York, believe it or not. Um, lots, lots happened. Um, you know, um, let's see, I, I moved. Uh, got a great family. Uh, I'm going to uh, getting married in the spring. So I'm real happy about that. Uh, my fiance's got two wonderful daughters that I adore, uh, both in their 20s. One has a, a baby, and uh, he, he's just a, he's just a cutie pie. His name's Jaden. Love him to death. Um, Drew has moved here to Ohio with me. Um, him and his husband. They're both working. Uh, Drew's a, got a management position, so I'm really proud of him. Uh, Steve is doing great. You know, he's working at a store he really loves. Uh, and everybody loves him. Um, let's see. Oh, I got a new dog. Uh, her name is Emma Jean. She's a pit bull. Uh, she's a, a therapy dog. She helps me out a lot. And, uh... Let's see, I'm trying to think of what else has happened. Um, just, uh, I'm doing a lot better, you know what I mean? I, I know that I've kind of came in and went on my videos, and I apologize. Um, sometimes it's really hard for me to do videos because I, I have, um, I get real nervous and have a lot of, anxiety uh, but I feel like that um, it's good therapy to have to do vlogs uh, about everyday things that's going on in your life even if it is like for two minutes to ten minutes to twenty minutes you should be able to talk about how you feel about things and how things are going in your life um, I got a doctor's appointment coming up uh, to get my get the ovaries out um, so there will not be any estrogen whatsoever running through this body <laughs> um, so they'll probably because they, they up my dose on my testosterone because the, the uh, ovaries was causing some some issues so um, <clears throat> I'm gonna get those out uh, first of the year and then um, be working on having um, some other surgeries uh, that's going to be coming up, which I'm really excited about. Hopefully the doctor can pull through for me on that. Uh, sadly, you know, where I'm at, um, there's a limited amount of doctors that will help uh, with that kind of stuff. Um the town that I live in is still they're, they're trying to catch up to the times but it's it's really still kind of hard um, so when I you know to get anything done I get it done more in Cleveland or Columbus which is pretty cool you know they're really cool over there for with me and um, I ran into a roadblock um, 
uh, about a month or so ago uh, because of my gender uh, on my uh, driver's license. I didn't want to get my driver's license because they were going to still put the F on there. And I was not wanting the F on there. So um, I did talk to my doctor and I finally got a paper, believe it or not, that uh, I can use to uh, get it to where I can get an F changed to an M. So that's that's pretty exciting. So I'm looking forward to getting my license back and being able to drive again because uh, I really miss it. And in, in this town, you know, um, I'm on disability, but there's little odd jobs that I could do if I get myself a truck. So just like little, little, you know, pissy ass jobs that I could do, but it's bringing in a little bit of money, you know. And besides, besides it gives me something to do. Um, not that I don't have enough to do around here, but you know, I need that, need that other job. Um, like I said, uh, I, I'm I I'm, I'm really sorry for the um, delays on the, the vlogs. It's just like I said, uh, it's like right now I'm, I'm nervous because <laughs> um, I'm gonna be doing these these vlogs again. So you know I'm, I still get a little nervous, and uh, but hopefully as more of the vlogs go on, um, that uh, I'll start feeling a lot better. And I'll be able to handle things a little bit better. Um, you know, someone asked me um, if I miss New York. I don't miss New York, the the city itself, because it was giving me a lot of anxiety. Um, but I do miss the people that's in it. You know, I miss my friends and, you know, people that I... So every day, I miss them, um, and even though, you know, I probably won't ever see them again, I think about them, um, so I miss them, you know, I, I, I do still miss them, um, let's see, uh, I'm trying to think if there's anything else, uh, the town that I live in, Believe it or not, if um, anybody's ever ever seen Shawshank Redemption, um, that movie of the prison that they filmed that at is here in this city, in this town. Um, so it's it's it was an actual you know <laughs> it's an actual prison thing going on, and of course you know I don't know if you all believe in that, but it's haunted as hell. I refuse to go in there. I don't want to go in there. My son wants to go in there. My fiance wants to go in there, but you know, no, that's not for me. <laughs> I was, you know, I, I'm afraid I'd get attacked or something, you know. Um, but this town is very, um, very well. Me and Drew call it the hell mouth because there's just so much paranormal here. If you believe in that sort of thing. Um, but like I said, um, back to what I was saying. Uh, this town is is not huge. It's probably for the people in New York. If you if you cut Brooklyn in half, it's probably about the size of Staten Island. Maybe that's it. Uh, maybe a little bit bigger than Staten Island. Um, so it's not like a big city, but you know it's it's good size. Um, but I like it here. Right now, we're thinking about moving out in the country and getting out of this part, you know, getting out of town, um, simply because we just like the quiet life, you know, we're not getting any younger, so we kind of like, you know, quiet, peaceful and quiet. There's a lot of nature here, you know, hopefully <clears throat> I can show you some of the, the nature uh, throughout the town, my vlogs and stuff. To continue to do them, like I said, I apologize because, like I said, as you could tell, I bounce all over the place. So just bear with me. I, I, I'm not good at vlogging too much, but, um, yeah, <laughs> uh, I'll do my best. I'll try to improve them every day, um, and make them better. So, 
there's no cutting, there's no editing, the only thing you're really going to be editing is putting the, the, the Taylor Project thing in, um, but, and that's pretty much it, there's really not going to be no, you know, cutting things out or whatever, um, if anything, I'll be stopping the video and just restarting it back up again, you know, pausing it, <clears throat> um, so yeah, <sighs> but I will try to send out videos as best I can to tell you about, you know, about everything that goes on in my life, uh, how things are going, like I said, there's a lot of changes going to be coming up, you know, um, let's see, uh, <laughs> Like, um, my surgeries, um, like I said, I still am doing my testosterone, um, it's going really well, I got a great doctor, uh, he's awesome, he is so awesome, um, and then, uh, um, my psychiatrist, uh, she's in Columbus, but she knew my psychiatrist, in New York, in Brooklyn, they went to school together, or went, you know, hung out together, or whatever, and, uh, so that's pretty cool, <laughs> um, so, yeah, I see her about every three months, so it's, you know, it's going pretty good on that, she's really